welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do a tutorial on how to do this look. Usually around the holidays I have a lot of events to go to like Midnight Mass and then obviously Christmas Day and any other kind of festivities. I want to wear a little more makeup and be a little more dramatic and more geared for the holidays. So this is the look I go for usually. I always go for the red lip and lashes as well. So if you want to see a tutorial on how to get a festive and gorgeous holiday look then just keep on watching just kidding i forgot to announce that i made a vlog channel so if you're into vlogmas or seeing what i do on christmas or my birthday that's coming up i will have the link down below to my vlog channel if you would like to check that out also if you haven't done so already subscribe to my subscribe to my channel and follow me on my social media as well Okay, for sure, that was it. Now let's get on with the video. So the first thing I'm gonna do is take my Anastasia Cream Contour Kit and then mix the first two lightest shades to highlight underneath my eye. And I just use my fingers to apply this. It's super easy. And yeah, you just wanna make yourself look like an, you're from an Indian tribe. And so I put that underneath my eyes and on the bridge of my nose and on my forehead and on my chin just to highlight the areas of my face. So next I'm going to take a foundation brush and mix the first two shades of the bronze, bronzing cream or whatever and then I'm going to put that in my, I don't know what this is called, on the sides of my nose and then on my forehead and then to contour my cheeks I just put it under kind of like my cheekbone that I don't really have but I'm trying to achieve and I don't really do this perfect or anything, I kind of just smear it everywhere and then just rely on my beauty blender to fix it. So then I'm just going to take my damp beauty blender and blend it all out and I always start with the highlighting first so that if you go with the bronzing first it gets dark on your beauty blender and you don't want your highlight to be dark so yeah go ahead and blend out the highlighter part and then go ahead and blend out your contour. Next, I'm going to do the baking method on my face and then just use the Laura Mercier translucent powder and then I go into my beauty blender and place this underneath my eye and I honestly totally believe in this baking method for your face. It totally makes you look so much better, honestly, and it really makes you go from like a 7 to a 10. And then I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Color Tattoo within a nude shade and then I'm just going to put that on the top part of my eye and then go into my Naked 2 palette and get this shade right here and put it in the crease of my eye and I really want this to be a really defined crease so I really really got a precise brush and really made sure that it was really defined. And then with the flat shader brush I'm just going to get the lightest shade in this palette and put that underneath my brow bone to highlight under there and yeah. And then with a different color tattoo, this one is bright gold and it's very shimmery so it's going to help the gold shadow that I'm going to put on this really really pop which is what I want. So I'm going to go with my Naked palette and get the gold shade that's in there. I think it's called Half Baked. And then you put that all over your lid and this really stands out against your really sharp and defined crease. Next I'm going to go in with the Kylie Burgundy palette and get a really thin um, eyeliner brush and put the color Dubai right in on top of my crease color and then gently blend it out. I really want it to be like a harsh line but blend it at the same time to add a pop of color and I really like the way it came out. And then I'm going to go with my Naked palette and get the darkest matte black shade in the palette and then put it in the outer V of my eye and then blend it all out. Next I'm just going to dust away all the powder that's on my face and blend it out again with my beauty blender to make it all come together. Then, and then to make my eyes pop even more, I'm just going to take this gold eyeliner and put it in my waterline. 
Next, I'm going to go back in with that thin liner brush and take that gold shimmery shade and put that on my lower lash line and my inner tear duct to make my eyes really pop. And then I'm going to get Dubai and then put that on the outer half of my lower lash line. And then I'm going to take any liquid liner, we'll do this job well, and then I'm just going to place the thin line over my eye and then do a slight wing at the end. And then I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply my favorite mascara, which is the Maybelline Colossal Mascara, and put that on my top and bottom lashes. And since it's a holiday look, I want to be a little extra, so I go in with individual false lashes, which are my favorite thing to do. And then, if you don't know how to apply these false lashes, you should just watch a YouTube video on how to do it. But basically, you just put a thin amount of glue on it and then put it right over your eyelashes with, uh, what are these things called? Tweezers. You apply them with tweezers. Sorry, I forgot what those are called for a second. But yeah, this is really natural and it really makes your eyes pop and... Again, adds an extra thing of oomph to your look, and I really like it. So that's the completed look with the lashes and eyeshadow on, and I really like the way it came out. And then I'm going to move on to my lips, which is my favorite part, and you want to make sure they're moisturized, so you want to put a new chapstick on. And then I'm going to go in with my Kylie Lip Kit Lip Liner in Leo, and just kind of line my lips. I really wanted like the perfect red look, but I don't have the perfect red color right now. So I'm just using this dark lip liner and then I'm going to put a lighter and brighter shade of red on top of it and it comes out really well. But yeah, you're just going to line your lips with that and then I'm going to take this really red shade and put that right over it. And again, it mixes really well and creates the perfect red color for your lips. So that completes my holiday look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this look and try it out. But yeah, I really like the way it came out. Thank you guys so much for watching this holiday festive glam video. I love doing makeup tutorials like this. So be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed watching. And also be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you'd like to see more holiday videos. I'm really sorry that I have taken like a week off. But I just finished my fall semester at Texas State. So getting through finals was really rough. But now I can dedicate all my extra time to YouTube. So I will be uploading quite a few holiday videos really soon back to back so if you'd like to see more holiday videos be sure to give it a big thumbs up and thank you guys so much for watching bye